This artificial river extends for a distance of 100 kilometers in the arid Egyptian desert at a cost of more than $5 billion for a fateful reason. The Egyptian government planning to convert this vast area of the Egyptian desert into green agricultural lands that achieve food sufficiency and security for Egypt. While this project is developing on Earth, let's take a look at the details of this revolutionary project and whether it is really possible to achieve this great goal, please hit the subscribe button if that is possible, and let's get started. Last year, the Egyptian president announced during the inauguration of the agricultural reclamation project, Egypt's Future, that the state is moving towards a large national project that will be built on an area of 2.2 million acres called New Delta. The project was called by this name to simulate the Great Nile River Delta, which has always represented the main source of fertile arable land over the years. This project aims to reclaim 1 million acres, and the rest of the area will be included in integrated infrastructure projects. Adds 15% of new cultivated area to Egypt within the framework of the state's strategy to achieve food security in the western desert near the northwest coast. The project site is distinguished by its proximity to ports and the new road network, which provides ease of transportation of goods, agricultural products, and labor also to and from the project. The project includes agricultural industrial complexes such as stations for packaging and processing agricultural products, which raises the added value of the project's products, in addition to stations for export, animal production, and dairy products. Construction is in full swing with an army of workers and heavy machinery transforming the landscape. The project includes extensive infrastructure development, including the construction of new canals, reservoirs, and pumping stations. These components will improve water management, improve irrigation systems, and ensure efficient distribution of water resources throughout the new delta. While discussing a project of this magnitude, surely this question will come to your mind. Where will Egypt provide water for this project? Well, this is the answer. First source, the northern source of irrigation is, a 170 km long waterway to transfer agricultural drainage water resulting from flood irrigation in the ancient lands of the delta, to a treatment plant to recycle, purify and treat it to make it suitable for irrigation instead of disposing of it in the Mediterranean Sea. This source consists of the following, 148 km open canals, 22 km of pipes and 13 lift stations, the eastern source of irrigation is represented by a 42 km long waterway to transport water generated from the southern and western sewage treatment plants in 6th of October city. It consists of the following, 16 km open canals, 26 km of pipes and 6 lift stations. Second source, underground water. The data confirmed the existence of massive amounts of groundwater under the sands of the western desert, especially the vast area southwest of the ancient Nile Delta in the western desert, which represents huge amounts of water sufficient to cultivate several million acres. Regarding the project benefits, it provides 5 million new job opportunities. The new delta also contributes mainly to Egypt's Vision 2030 to support the food security file and achieve sustainable development, represented in preserving, maintaining, and developing the available agricultural economic resources, achieving a great deal of food security, reducing the import gap, and establishing new integrated agricultural communities. Strengthening the competitiveness of agricultural products in the local and international markets, providing job opportunities, especially for youth and women, and adapting to climate change. It is worth noting that the new Delta project is part of parallel projects of the same quality in different regions across Egypt, such as the South Valley Development Project with an area of 1.1 million acres, the North and Central Sinai Development Project with an area of 456,000 acres, the new Egyptian Rural Development Project with an area of 1.5 million acres, in addition to other projects in some governorates of Upper Egypt and the New Valley, with an area of 650,000 acres. Tell us in the comments your opinion on this mega project and do you think it will achieve its goals in the end or not? Thank you for joining us on this informative journey. If you found this episode insightful, be sure to subscribe to our channel and hit the notification bell to stay updated on more mega projects from around the world. Until next time, keep exploring.